the channel. Today we are doing an insane unboxing. We have over a thousand dollars worth of stuff um, to show you guys. So we're back at the headquarters, but while I was at school, I was shopping away, spending money I shouldn't have, but now we get cool unboxing videos. But I've been dropping a lot of money um, on random things, and so we're gonna show you. We're gonna start at the bottom of like some light work thing, something that you could probably get. And then we're gonna work our way up to some crazy things. As you can see, there's already a few little, I'm gonna hide this box here so you can't see that, even though you probably know what it is. And then obviously you can see those shoes, but we'll get to that in a second. Um, so yeah, a lot of these things were either like free and, or whatever, or a crazy drop, or I won some things, which we're gonna get to in a second, which is insane, um, the amount of money that I didn't have to pay for this item. Um, and how cheap I got it, you literally won't believe it. Uh, but starting off, we have just a classic, a classic here. If you don't know what this is, this is the Supreme Bouncy Ball. Yeah, I know, a bouncy ball with a little Supreme Box logo. I'm gonna put it right up to the camera. You probably won't be able to see it, because it's dark. Um, but it's literally a bouncy ball with um, Supreme Box logo on the inside. I got this for $10 off someone on Depop. It was a free gift, I wanna say, Two years ago, maybe two years ago, and I was like, you know what? I need a little light thing to add to the collection. Little box logo. There it is. Um, so yeah, that's the first little piece. I know, pretty, pretty easy. Ten dollars, you could get that too. The next item is this little package here. This is from Sneaker News. If you don't know what Sneaker News is, it's a Twitter, it's an Instagram, it's a website. They post all like. Anything that comes out with sneakers, anything hyped, where to get them, how to get them, um, any news throughout the week, like, you know, we have updates on shoes, if, like, pictures get released, they're always the first to post it, um, and say, so always do free stuff for people who subscribe to their emails, so definitely subscribe, use a Gmail so you get you know, notifications right away, um, and then you get free stuff, you just have to pay shipping. So this shirt right here, I'm gonna open it up, this is an insiders only shirt, um, again, all you have to do is sign up. You don't have to pay or anything to get this stuff. You know, just when they release it, like, they'll send you a special link and then you can get it. So this is the Insider's Tee. And man, they really outdid themselves here. Um, they actually put in a little baggie there. Last shirt I got, they just threw it in the, one of these little bags and that was it. They're upping it. They're upping it up here. Here we go. So yeah, they're not any ridiculous um, little sneaker news insider little card there um, I have like 20 of these they don't give you a really nice shirt like it's not like dry fit or anything but it's like a nice little cotton tee that when you wash it it gets pretty soft and it gets pretty nice so this is the sneaker news insiders only tee so you have it's just a black shirt with a little pocket almost uh, print and it has a little sneaker news logo and then insiders only pretty basic but I love sneaker news and I just like what they do and I use them a lot so anytime I can get you know free merch uh, you know so I paid five dollars for this shirt I mean where can you get a shirt for five dollars next up we have another sneaker news item and that is the sneaker news Wilson collab mini basketball Wilson as you know they make footballs basketballs all types of sports equipment and that sneaker news I just talked about that a lot they did a full-size basketball release, but you had to be like entered from a raffle. But then they dropped these for free, like I said, when all you have to do is pay shipping. And this one was $8, I think. Super dope. I mean, I don't know if you can really see the like shininess there. I mean, it's so clean, the Sneaker News Wilson. And then it comes with this fire stand. And I don't know if you're gonna be able to see this, but it has Sneaker News and Wilson engraved. Get a look at that, probably not, you can't see it, but it makes a nice little stand and it's definitely going in the collection. Um, how to grab that because you know, trying to collect those sneaker news stuff. And then they gave you a dope little sneaker news card with a bunch of like writing and signatures on it. And so it seems like this is a collab we might see more from. So definitely sign up for the emails because they might drop more Wilson and sneaker news collabs because it says at the end here. Um, starting off this collaboration with this so like they're starting off with this piece there might be more so definitely want to hit that up <sighs> what's next what's next all right we'll do this one next this is the most insane thing I mean it's not we're gonna get some more insane things but this is insane uh, if you don't know Jacob star he does you know, YouTube he does Instagram pics he's super fire he's so many nice things I love his pictures 
but he also does raffles on Robitussin and Poppy. I'm gonna put the Instagram right here. And so I always like see his stuff and it's like, you know, $10 to enter, but then there's like 40 or 50 slots and it's just like, doesn't seem worth it. The day uh, he dropped like a $5 one and I was like, sure, I'll join it. I joined it, I didn't win. The next day he had a dollar entry for two sweatshirts. You know, if you won, you know, if you, you know, didn't get the first one, you get the second one or like whoever wins first gets the pick. And so I was like, a dollar, like, whatever. I messaged him, I'm like, how many, you know, slots? He's like, I'm gonna have 500. So like, one in 500 chance. Yeah, okay, right, whatever. Uh, one dollar, I can, you know, gamble away a dollar. I don't watch his live video. I usually watch all of his live videos. He sends me a message. Bro, you won. I was like, no way. What sweatshirt do you want? So I was able to grab the Classic Ad Supreme sweatshirt in a size large for $1. And it is absolutely gorgeous. I love this sweatshirt so much, mostly because the Supreme New York is small, but it has the Lafayette, you know, address, and it's so nice. It is a large, I probably would be able to fit a medium better, but like, you know, it's legit, it's got all the tags and everything. So I looked this up, I mean, this is selling at like 150. Um, so I got a $150 sweatshirt for $1. Um, and the material is insane. I've never had like an actual Supreme sweatshirt in hand and it is so nice like I wore this out and it was freezing cold it was so warm the entire time because it's just so clean um, and the inside is so soft so if you ever get a supreme sweatshirt you're I mean $160 does seem ridiculous but man it is worth it like the stitching everything is gorgeous on this and I'm so happy to add this to my collection and I just want to shout out Robin Tussa Poppy and Jacob Starr for making this happen because like you know if he didn't have that raffle uh, you know, I wouldn't be having this. And so you should definitely follow him. He posts a lot if you want to raffle stuff or, you know, get raffles. Um, the next piece is super dope. Um, so this is from Carlos. Um, I love Supreme and it's not always for the brand. It's mostly for the community that goes with it. And so uh, San Francisco store opened and they had an ad in the San Francisco Chronicle. And I just hit in the comments of a sneaker community or supreme community uh post i was like yo anybody got one i'll buy it dude hits me up we made a deal i think we made it ten dollars fifteen dollars uh for this so if you open it up which it's, um, it's kind of hard to show you on camera but if you open it up we have a full size supreme ad in there for the supreme san francisco store and it is so sick it's a lot smaller than what i thought which is great because then i can frame it and put it somewhere but as you can see, we have Supreme and then the store address down there at the bottom. And then you have this guy like skating. But it was really cool because this is like grabbing a piece of history. Like, you know, a few years down the line, this is going to be worth something. I don't plan on selling it. Like, I'm going to keep it in my collection. But it's such a unique thing because, you know, I've never gone to San Francisco. But yet I was able to get this due to the community that is built around Supreme. So I think it's really cool. And that's why I really love the brand and the community that goes with it. Um, because it's just nice to meet new people and this dude was super great. I'm gonna put his Instagram right here Definitely hit him up follow him um, Yeah, so shout out Carlos for hooking me up with that and then oh my gosh just when I thought It couldn't get any better We have another package and the reason I put this after the Supreme San Francisco store is I Just cannot believe this What is, what? That's right, Supreme San Francisco uh, store opening box logo tee. I grabbed this on the drop uh, the Monday after on supreme.com, you know, like Supreme New York. I cannot believe I have this in my hand right now. I thought they weren't really gonna drop it. Like, they, you know, they did a shock drop for the Brooklyn tee. They're not gonna do it again. And they did. And I got card declined like five times, but finally it went through. Picked this up for 60 bucks. I think that's what it came out to, and it is on StockX right now for like 400. So I'm probably gonna sell this, um, but man, it is so clean. I want to open it. Man, it's this little tiny wrapper is you know keeping me from uh, opening this one up because it does have that cool design on the back that says like beautiful people, beautiful place or something like that. But absolutely dope. Uh, I love this a lot, and I'm really thankful that I was able to get this. Um, yeah, so that goes along with the San Francisco store too. The next piece is pretty obvious. You can see it here. These are the Yeezy Clouds. 
Um, they're pretty, uh, they're freaking pretty hard, but I think they're gorgeous. Like, I love these shoes so much. Um, and so I am posting a few dope pics on my uh, Instagram, so you can go check them out. But these are absolutely gorgeous. I'm going to keep these for the personal. So sorry you can't buy them, but if you want, literally go on StockX, they're under retail um, there. But these are just so gorgeous, and I think if these came out like three years ago, four years ago, I think these would have gone off. Like I think so many people would have bought these. It's just a beautiful colorway, like the blues are so nice, and then with the white underneath, obviously with the foam, and then the icy bottoms, just looks super nice. Um, yeah, so another nice pickup. I've had these for a while, but um, you know since release day. But I didn't want to. I didn't make a video, so I thought I'd throw them in here. Now the next shoe is something that I said I was gonna um, talk about like the next day I got it, but I thought I'd just wait for this video, and that is the Travis Scott Air Force Ones. Um, in man, it is just gorgeous. The box itself is beautiful. I mean, look at the top with the blue. So nice. Again, there's gonna be pictures of these on my Instagram as well. But let me just open these up and show you one shoe. Just because I keep taking them in and out and I don't want to mess up the paper. I want to keep them as dead stock as possible. But I'm gonna pull one out for you. Show you what we got here. My pictures on Instagram show them pretty well. Um, but let's move that out the way. There we go. So this is the shoe here. So you have the two different laces um, and then you have this tongue cover, which I wish I could take off, but it's like, weaved through the laces like the laces are through it so I don't want to redo the whole thing and I like I said I want to keep it as dead stock as possible um, so yeah on this side you have all these different colors you got these nice blues and I guess like orangey colors you got some purple the other side is my favorite because you have this camo swoosh I think that looks so clean um, so these are like I said the Travis Scott and the way I got these is pretty insane I spoofed my location if you don't know what that means you literally tell your phone it's somewhere else than where it actually is using a uh, different software. I used iTools and I was able to just tell my phone and sneakers that I was at the Astro World Festival um, in Houston, Texas and literally just popped up, hit buy now and there it was. These are going for around 550, 600 um, as of right now. Um, before I keep going, I do wanna say I will be posting these, the box logo T and I think there was something else. No, that's it. Just these two on my Instagram to sell. Um, so these are going on StockX for $550. i will have them up on my Instagram for around $500. These are a size 10. And then we have the Supreme Box logo, like I said. This is a size medium. This is going for $400. I'll have it up there for $350. Um, so yeah, go definitely hit it up um, and you can buy these off of me. But super clean piece. I'm really thankful I was able to get them. Check out my picks. Make sure to like and comment. Um, that's going to wrap up this video. If you enjoyed all these unboxings, go ahead and smash the like button because I'm going to try to get more stuff so we can, you know, obviously make more videos. But some of these things, it's just like there's no way I can recreate it. Like there's no way I'm going to be able to win another sweatshirt for a dollar. Maybe I do. That'd be amazing. But um, that's going to wrap it up. Have an awesome day. And uh, yeah, see you later.